hello viewers this is plantain and it is ready for harvesting in fact there is over maturity many a times whenever you come across such some things example is when you see the whole fruit bunch cracking you may think it is a disease it is not a disease it is due to the physiological status or the physiological states of the whole plantain plant before we harvest this particular plantain because it has even overgrown we are going to harvest it now now let's take a look at the stem of this particular plantain here is it this is it and this is its stem in fact you can see that even the stem is now becoming weaker because if you look at the size of the fruit bunch, it is not just a small bunch. You can see a symptom of um, cracking. Also, there is also a support. Before we do the harvesting, I'm going to remove the support. And then you can see that almost all the leaves of the uh, plantain is becoming drier and drier day in and day out because it has completed the life cycle the life cycle has completed so we are going to harvest it now now this is how the whole process goes now first of all we pull out this support um, at a, set, a certain stage of growth. Um, without the support, in fact, it is likely that the plantain will fall prematurely because of our nature of the soil here. In fact, these particular plants, they were not, we did not um, intentionally, they were not intentionally planted. When we did the nursery, we decided to leave some of these things on the best. And that is all we have, including all this. So, this is how the harvesting goes. Now, because there is this support, we are going to remove the support. Now, after removing the support, Here we go. So good. This is the food bunch that we have. You gotta we call this the Apantu variety. In fact, this is how it goes. It looks so nice. And in fact, it is fully grown. You can see that this one has even ripe. Uh -huh. This is the symptoms that it is exhibiting. Most of the um, the fruit has cracked. If you look at this one, there's also a symptom of fruit cracking. It just cracked. And it is not that it is a disease. This is not a disease. It occurred, the cracking occurred as a result of over maturity. If you see this, particular plantain uh, fruit bunch it has over matured and what happens is that once the plantain reaches maturity then automatically the starch which is stored inside this fruit bunch 
um, scientifically turns into sugar. That is sucrose. And when that happens, at a temperature of 21 degrees Celsius and above, at humidity of 90% um, relative humidity, you can see that ripening begins. And automatically, plants usually store their food in the form of starch. Uh, most plant, most green plants. That is the life of photosynthesis. Yes. Um, after the food preparation using sunlight, um, carbon dioxide, uh, mineral salt to you know manufacture its own food. The food is stored as uh, in the form of carbohydrate. It is stored as starch. So once it is over maturing or once it is fully matured, then the process of ripening also begins. And that is how you see that most of them are ripened. The whole process of plantain ripening um, shall be explained vividly on the board within the lectures, uh, the farmer's lecture room. And everybody will get a full understanding of it. But these crackings that you see, they were as a result of over maturity you see that it has happened we want to in fact we we person i personally left these things for our viewers to see what is going on um for the purpose of practicals that is how come we have let the plantain to grow up to this level so now you can see the size of our fruit bunch here um it is super amazing we have let me count the fingers you can see this one particularly uh, we have about the first one which is one two three four five six seven eight uh nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen sixteen um seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six and 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36 um, fingers on one um, uh, 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 fruit bunch. This is a fruit bunch and each fruit contained on the fruit bunch, we had 36 fingers. Yeah. So for the purpose of practicality, I can tell you, we want to vary the range of fingers in um, plantains so that we can, you know, jump into conclusion. I personally do not believe in literature. So whatever we do at Smart Agro Innovation, we want to prove to you that it is real and physical. As we speak, we need more information on plantain. And that is how come every idea we try as much as possible, um, plantains to bananas, we put every information about them out there for the purpose of um, learning to achieve um, um, higher height as a farmer. So this is what we have. If you go to your farm and you see this symptom, I tell you it is not a disease, but rather it is over maturity. So when over maturity occurs, this is what you are likely to see. If you see it um, at the farm, don't say that it is um, some disease. So that is how the whole thing goes. As I said earlier, I said this is not a symptom of a disease. The cracking began here and ended there. You see that there are a lot of symptoms like that here. You can still see some that one. You can still see this one too that cracking also occurred. This is um, fruit cracking that result as a result of over maturity. Over maturity causes this uh -huh. because the whole thing has over matured that is how come you can see it this way thank you very much for watching this is smart agro once again um before we end the whole thing i'm going to harvest it cut everything this is just a, a backyard a fruit bunch this is just at the backyard you know so here we go because i don't want the fruit to fall because it may break in the process that is why so you can see a lot of what we have 
as a food bunch <laughs> just at the backyard this is the food we are producing yes we eat what we produce and we produce what we eat this is right at the backyard as you can see and this is the size of the uh, plantain fruit bunch that i've gotten so far <laughs> farming is indeed a beautiful thing it's a great thing and it pays to be a farmer start today and this is just the backyard very soon i'm going to take you to the main farm and you see what is happening there you know so this is just one bunch i can't even lift it it's very heavy yes and we have 36 um fingers on it you see it is it has even started ripening and you can see uh -huh. i tell you there are 36 fingers on it and it's very heavy in ghana we call it the apentu variety thank you very much for watching this is smart agro innovation if today is your first day of watching us please kindly subscribe to the channel share to farmer friends to help promote the work thank you very much may god bless you